In our last episode, the king's twin nephews, Duke and Earl. I'm Duke. Th 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 that's Earl, folks. <laughs> yes. Well, the twins had joined the Bongo Congo Boy Scouts and requested that King Leonardo act as their substitute patrol leader. Excited by the idea of wearing a uniform, the king consented, but soon found that there was more to being a patrol leader than he thought. He had a little trouble with a knot tie. More trouble demonstrating first aid. And some difficulty with a signal. OK, fellas, leave them up and brush them off. So it was that the king was dismayed to find out that he was to take the wolf patrol camping in the morning. It's a contest, Uncle Lenny, to see which patrol is the best camper. We'll call you uh, at 6 o'clock. When the twins called at the royal bedchamber at 6 o'clock the next morning, the royal body was sound asleep in the royal bed, snoring royally. <laughs> Hey, look, Earl. He's still asleep. Yeah, asleep. Maybe we ought to give him a wolf patrol call. Yeah, call. We're being attacked by Martian guards. My Earl, that call certainly does get attention, doesn't it? Well, let's pick him up and brush him off. Confound it! Cut that out. Now that he was alert and wide awake, the king lost no time in starting on the camping trip. All right, men, follow me. <laughs> All right, men, let's pick him up and brush him off. <laughs> Having gotten off with a flying start, King Leonardo led the patrol through the woodland, teaching them all the little tricks of the experienced woodsmen, such as locating the best place to cross a stream. Or how to slip silently through the forest like an Indian. Shh. Well, let's pick him up and brush him off. But it was after they got to the camping ground that the king really imparted his wide knowledge of living in the outdoors. He showed them how to pitch a tent. The first thing you do is pound the tent pegs into the ground. Real woodsmen use a stone for a hammer like this. <laughs> All right, men, get bandages. Yeah, bandages. Next, King Leonardo showed them how to keep their food supply safe. See, you just pull it up high, tie a good knot, and there you are. All right, men, get bandages. Yeah, bandages. When it came to mealtime, the king showed them how to make a fire Indian fashion. Very simple. Just hold the fireboard down with your foot and move the bow back and forth rapidly. The friction makes heat and the heat makes fire! Oh, 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 oh my foot! Oh, oh. All right, men, get bandages! Yeah, bandages. He showed them how to chop trees for firewood. And burn! When the camping contest was over, Wolf Patrol had won no prizes for tent pitching, fire building, or tree chopping. But... And because of the hard work of King Leonardo, Wolf Patrol wins first prize for hooray! first aid. Hooray for Uncle Annie! Yeah, hooray! Three howls for Uncle Annie! <laughs> Don't miss the next... Ridiculous adventure of the King and Odie. <laughs> <laughs>